Oh wow. And here we are. What is this fucking Congo jungle? Turn this shit down a little bit. Is this fucking? Is are we, are we in Donkey Kong? Kinda. Or oh, so you can jump really high. Oh my god. Dad's been working out. Oh, that that laggy, the laggy um, the attack is that would fuck me. So well, that's, that's why the game's hard. So what is this shit? Uh, this is Magisite, which is a 2D platforming, crafting, survival, roguelike. Looks like Minecraft. Well, the only thing that's similar to this, between this and Minecraft, is that you can, can mine trees. and chop trees. Like, the you've got, you know, axe. Axe, sword, pick. That's the only similarity. Everything else is completely different. But combat, you're, just, you're just killing things with the axe right now. Yeah, but it'll break soon, and I need to make a new one. Fuck. And that's what you get the sticks from? So wait, can you get to a point where you just, like, kill enemies with the axe, and then you don't have anything to make a new thing with? Okay, where's my wood? Here it is. So you get the wood, and you turn it into planks. Oh my god. And you get the herbs, and you turn them into potions. Oh. And then you get the sticks, and you combine them together, and then you get a pick handle, and you put these together, and you get a blade. Oh and then you my! Take the blade, combine it with that, and you get a pick. Oh my god! And you do this, and you combine it with this, and then you do this. Oh god! And you do. Oh god! And then you. And then you. Oh my! You're trying to do this really quick. God! It's really this bit. This like really is boring. Oh, we got a uh, unique sword. What? Sometimes swords just have stats. It's cool. Oh my we'll never god! Need that. Actually, we're gonna craft this together. Big potion. Oh, what is this Minecraft shit? Notch, get out of my game. Nathan, you're just being salty because. It pretty much, yeah, it is. It is pretty much. That's very Minecrafty. Okay, let me guess. This was made recently. Uh, pretty damn recently. Yeah. Yeah. It's 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 still an early access. After the baby boom of video games. Baby boom. Where all the babies started playing games. Yeah. True. <laughs> yeah. Actually, no, you're right. Yeah. Well, because gaming audiences are getting. I think you know everyone's saying like, oh, adults play video games more than kids, but like nah, super man. kids, no, super kids are starting to play games more as well. Like everyone's playing games. Super and shit. kids? Did I miss something? Like, you know, like baddie kids. Yeah. What? Yo, oh, you mean like very kids? Very kids. Yeah. Very yeah, super kids. Very children. They're very, very children. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I don't know. It's certainly See a way. Up there? It's certainly a way to appeal to people, but don't just chuck, don't chuck shit into your game just because it's good. No, the game does revolve around craft. The crafting is very interesting. Yeah, I mean, it looks like it serves itself well, but at the same time. Uh, if you die, you lose all your progress, yeah? You lose everything, yeah. So but then you unlock sort of uh, beginning traits. Like Rogue Legacy, you unlock beginning traits that kind of make the game slightly easier at the start. Okay. So you unlock like races and stuff, and some yeah, of them start with better weapons. Die, and Yeah, I know. Uh, it Dying also, is really fucking easy to do in this game, by the way. It also looks like... Oh. It also looks like uh, Scribble Knots. It plays a lot like Scrib Scribble Knots. Scribble Knots. Scribble Bob. Scribble Bobs. We played that on the show, didn't we? We did. That was silly. It's very silly. What a silly game. We kept on. We, what do you make? We made it like a flaming demon baby. Uh, jetpacks work too. <laughs> jetpacks solve every problem with scribble knots. So these big blocks, they're unique to the first area and they're really fucking annoying. Yeah, it seems like a really, really, uh, like annoyingly challenging platforming task to be asking of people learning the game. Yeah, no, the first area is like disastrously difficult. It actually gets like a fair bit easier. Well, so what? You can't do that. That's that's not how difficulty progression you know, you take works. The stone. Oh god. And what if we what have we learned from last time? You take the things, put them together, and you take those things. That doesn't mean you can't just mash fucking rocks together and make a, whatever that is. Yeah, you can. You could. Oh, okay. All right. You, okay. You just made. You can mash most things. Together. You just made a brick bone. Yeah. You make a refined bone. That. That. Okay. But I've been playing this game a lot. It's actually quite good. Like it's surprisingly deep. It doesn't. There's no way to like sort of break the game. Like a lot of games like this have that problem where it's like there's a dominant strategy and it kind of gets a bit shitty and boring and so um, to make a picky, make a. Seems axe seems like the dominant strategy would be to make weapons and then kill people with the weapons. Pick handle, find stone. Ah, oh, stone blade. There we go. Okay. So we can like check. Uh, out. Well, selling you, stuff doesn't really give you much. How and do then we'll you, make a bone sword. How do you determine um, what kind of handle you make? Uh, oh, sorry, what kind of an blade? You, what kind of blade do you make? Axe. Oh, uh, that's just by getting different stone, uh, different materials, and making shit. No, but like, I mean, how do you make a sword compared to an axe? Or is that uh, based on the handle? An or? axe is two sticks. A sword is a stick and a bit of a uh, plank. And a sword, a uh, pick is an axe handle plus a stick. Oh god! And there goes my axe. So how do you learn that shit? Mm -hmm. do they it's really easy. It's trial and error. Do they teach you it? No. 
I had to look up how to make picks, I think, and that was it. Everything else. God, I, I hate that out. shit. It's really no, it's really intuitive. No, I don't like that because I don't. Well, if they don't teach you, it might be intuitive. But if they don't teach you it, like, what, do they expect you to go to the wiki? No, and no. It just I just tried it until I got it. It was really easy. I guess because I'm not a fucking idiot, and I had more than ten minutes to spare to think about how to play the game. You know. No, but like, like people want games to be played for them, and it's like if I if I want around like I wouldn't. I don't know. It's just like what what if you don't get it. No, just obviously you would obviously you play around with the crafting system to get shit, but that's, that's a very you've answered your own question. It's a very simple thing to just say. Well, well they, you, they you someone they, a all they tell you is try wood and wood. That's all you need. That's all you need to know. Okay. And you will work this game out. I don't know. I like I like it when they give basic recipes for things like that, and then they let you figure out all the rest of the shit. Not necessary. You can beat the game without crafting at all. Oh what? Doesn't your shit break? Yeah. Can you find stuff like weapons? Yeah. Oh. Here we go. Oh my god, three so doors. There's three doors. So this is the ice biome, ice biome, and then swamp biome. And swamp is nice and easy. And they're always random? And then you get a town. And that's the first area. Oh wow. So that's how this game plays. And you need to eat food. Where was the first town before you went in this fucking hellhole? Oh shit, we need a rock. Uh, whatever, we can just eat raw food. Does somebody want a rock? Why are you shitting everywhere? Because we're eating. <laughs> that doesn't... Alright, so okay. okay. Okay, I'll go with that. Let's go to this guy. So surely this has control support. Actually, no. I guess it, it does, but it's not that great. Yeah. Uh, we don't want that. What's the like the best way to do control support oh, no. in this game is like to have some kind of cursor in the menus, maybe. Actually, no. You would just. It's all very square based. So I suppose you just, just um. D-pad and yeah. move around would be good. All right. Now what do we need? We've got 148 gold, so we can get a bone axe. We don't really need anything from here. You can just right, make bone axes. So we've only got one little bit of ironite ore, and you go to that guy to turn it into bars. Uh, why don't you do that? Or do you have to pay money? We've only got one. You need two to turn it into a bar. Fuck. And these guys aren't worth wasting charges with your weapon on. Are you kidding? You're actually just gonna disrespect him that much that you punch him. And now we got a shield. So what does that upgrade do? Well, you I leveled just, up you into just the, leveled up into the warrior. You specked into the, the red tree, which is the beating you up tree. Yeah. And that gives you an active ability? Mm-hmm. What does that one do? Uh, it gives you massively like increased armor for a little bit. Oh. Or it gives everyone in your party that. Oh shit, that fucking party system right off the bat. Oh well, yeah, because there's multiplayer. And I think the multiplayer would be quite good. I haven't had a chance to try it. But it's online only. Yeah. Which is weird. As you can imagine, because scrolling screens only work with. Yeah. And yeah. see, because I have a stone pick now, I get iron out of these. Oh, so it depends Ooh, on the pick coal. you use. And some coal, so. I'm a fire starter. Now we can cook meat when we get enough. That's, are you hitting that thing with... What are you hitting that thing with? Actually, I need to... Ah, I shouldn't have gotten rid of my spider webs. What do they do? You can make string, and then you can make net, and you combine net with a stick, and you get a... Uh, Fly catcher. Yeah, and you capture these bugs, and you combine the bugs into gems, and you put the gems in weapons. You combine the bugs. That is cruelty against well, animals. Yeah. Like, they're called thunder bugs, so you get put two thunder bugs together, you get a uh, thunder gem. Wow. Which makes sense. It's intuitive. Like I don't know if that. that makes sense, man. They're bugs. You don't squish that shit together. Well, I tried it and I got a thing. And you okay. put it in weapons and you get... It makes sense in the context of, weapons. of this crazy ass fucking world. I wouldn't, I wouldn't go out and try and mash two flies together. Maybe if I was a kid. If I was new to the earth as a child, maybe I'd try that out. You never did anything you were in your child. I don't think I did, no. <laughs> That's why I'm, I'm so lacking in everything shit. now. Lacking in stats. So why don't you make a better- can you make a better pickaxe right now? Like, is a bone pickaxe better? No. Stone and bone are the same, more or less. It's just cosmetic? Uh, I think bone has more durability. Ooh. Oh, we got the stummy grumblies. Alright, let's make a fire. And... Where's your hunger? Oh god, all of your stats are up. What is fucking- what is that game that, like, you had to survive on an island? And you could drink salt water and you'd die? I don't remember. I don't know if it was ever popular, I just remember playing it once. Um, now, yeah, now we need some spider so let's go to Iceland. There's spiders in the Iceland. No, it's just, let's just go to Iceland. Okay. Also, everything is worth the same. This is just a way to get rid of bulk shit that you don't want. Alright. Sticks are good, but we don't need that many. Um, you got, you got quite a few sticks. We need some fire starters. Is it one, one fire starter per cooking thing? One fire starter per fire. Per, per session. Okay, now we don't have enough ore to do anything interesting, so we just save the inventory space. Oh, you got a bow. Wait, you're, so you're on five life right now. Shouldn't you buy potions? You can't. Oh. Drink one. Fuck. Uh, what's my bone sword? 
42 out of 60. Alright, let's get on the sword. The last thing you want to do is run out of sword charges, because you will get dicked. Oh wait, that's your experience. That's your life. I've been looking at the top left for your life. Yeah, I know, that's I what mean, I like, do. What that's why I, I used to die a lot, because I didn't look at my health and shit. I was like, does it take a long time to regen your health after drinking a potion, or are you just going to be on five forever? Okay, that's a boss. This, this lady? Ah, oh, fuck, we're fucked. Oh god. Can you just GTFO? I'm gonna die in a second. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, my oh god. god, there's two of them? I've never killed these. Three? That's the ice lady. There's three of them. What the fuck? Those things have like five, like 5,000 health each. What? Yeah. That's why I don't like going to Iceland. And we unlock the Berserker Scarf. What? <laughs> why did they... Th what? And that's a run. And now you can go back and you can put on a hat. So and this gives you a chance to get additional attack when you level up. And then the game's slightly easier. Well, try it again. Wait, how many? Wait, how do, you race, how do you unlock races? There's each one has a different thing. Twenty percent chance to after unlock after doing a thing. Twenty percent chance. You're just good. Ah! But if you don't unlock them, you get bonus points if you run. Oh, these guys are really good. What do points do? I like all classes. I don't know. Nice class. And hey, we'll go to a new episode. We'll do another run with our little berserker scarf on. We'll try a different. He looks. He's looking pretty hot right now.